In just one week, San Antonio artists will open their doors for the 12th annual On and Off Fredericksburg Rogue Studio Tour. Presented by Bill House Art, the annual tour lets the public see artwork by dozens of artists in their own homes. Here to tell us how it works are Kelly McIntyre, Executive Director of Bill House Arts, and artist Cody Vance. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thank, you. Wow. Thank you for having us. What is this? It's a little bit of stone sculpture. We got a Belgian black marble mounted on Texas, good old Texas granite. That is fantastic. So is this what we'll see? That's part of it. When you come by our studio, you're going to see a lot of stone sculpture and paintings and by friends of mine that are going to be there as well. OK, so let me go back to the okay. beginning. On and off Fredericksburg oh, Road, what is it? On and off Fredericksburg Road is the largest studio tour, art studio tour in San Antonio. Uh, this is our 12th year. And this year, you'll see uh, that we have about 44 uh, studios open during the tour. Uh, the tour takes place February 16th and 17th. Um, and the studios are open. This is the only time that the artist studios are open all year round uh, during the year. So it's a really a wonderful opportunity to see something you're not going to see every day. You can't get into those studios unless you're taking the tour. So the way to take the tour is to purchase the catalog. It comes in two uh, versions. We have a hard copy um, uh, that has the map inside, or we also have an online app. Both of those are $10, and you can go to on and off Fred, O N A N D O F F F R E D dot org, uh, and purchase the catalog. Mm -hmm. uh, or you can purchase one at the door at Beale House. Uh, we also have several locations around the city that are, are carrying the catalog, and if you go to our website, uh, those are listed. Um, so you pick up a catalog, you want to do it in advance, a couple of days in advance, uh, spend a little time with the catalog, look through it, see what artists you want to see, dog ear those pages. Uh, mark your map and then you're ready to go and you can spend an hour or two on the tour on either Saturday or Sunday you can spend a whole day or you can do a really good job and uh, see everything in, in the two full days it's about a 15 mile driving tour mm -hmm. um, so um, you do kind of need to plan okay so I understand you will probably be a part of this mm -hmm. right yes, so is, this is one of your pieces, yes. you, you'll show more. Mm -hmm. For you as an artist, what does this mean to you? It's great because we get to connect one-on-one -on -one with our community. A lot of people come out from outside of San Antonio even, but to be able to get there with the people in our community and show them what's going on in the community and get them involved. We've had people at the house who, who said, okay, I'm gonna go back and, and try some of this and try some of that. And they're telling us about all the other stops that they've had on the tour that they're they're just really fascinated that this was, it's a, a hidden gem, but now it's not so hidden and you see the same faces coming back and they're telling you the stories of what they learned and what they took out. And so it's, it's evolving and it's and exploding and it's, it's just a great community. So I can, I can imagine that this is great exposure for you mm -hmm. guys. You get to the, the connectivity right. of you and, and the, you know, the art lover for right. the first time because some may not know about you, but after this, they know who you right. are. And one of the most intriguing things I found with the very first tour I was on, you go out there as a stone carver, so you're expecting people to come to your house because they saw that there and they were, they're interested in the, in the sculpture. But I had a lot of geologists and stone heads come out. And oh, that oh, was oh. really interesting because they were telling me things about the stone that I'd never heard of before. And, and you know, they'd go down in these deep dark caves and they're finding all these. Just, it was awesome, awesome. This is wonderful. How long has this been going on, Kelly? Well, this is our 12th year. Uh, wow. We started 12 years ago. I think we had 20 artists on the tour. Uh, the catalog was really a pamphlet. Now it's over 100 pages. We've got uh, over 70 artists this year. And it, you never know what you're going to see. You, you walk into a, a new studio, one you've never been into before. You open the door, and it's just magical. I mean, you get to meet the kids, the cats, the dogs. You uh, see how the <laughs> artists live. You uh, sometimes they'll be doing a demo in their in their in their studio, or you can ask them how they do something, and they'll actually show you. Uh, so it's it's one of the few times that you really get that intimate relationship with the artist. When you see artwork in a gallery, for exa example, and I run a gallery. Galleries are wonderful. I run Beale House Arts, where we organize the tour. But when you go see art in a gallery, it's usually on a white wall. Uh, and the artist is is not there unless you know the opening reception but the artist is usually not there so you talk to uh, whoever's running the gallery when you go to an artist studio you meet the artist you see how they live 
Uh, you see their work, you see some of their work in progress because everything's not finished in their studio. There are pieces that are in, in different stages of production. Wow. And you get to sit and you can ask them anything, really virtually anything. And they're comfortable in their own studio, so they're going to be, it's, it's going to be a more intimate conversation. Uh, a more one-on-one -on -one conversation. Uh, it's just a, it's a wonderful, wonderful opportunity to see something you've probably never seen before. Sounds like a great idea. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look at this information mm -hmm. one more time. Just in case you want to scribble this down, uh, it is... It is on and off of Fred or, dot org. O-N-A-N-D-O-F-F-F-R-E-D dot org. Uh, this Saturday, uh, co this coming Saturday, February 16th from um, uh, 11 a.m. to 6 on Saturday and then Sunday the 17th from noon to 5 p.m. We also have an opening reception on Friday night, uh, February 16th. All right. Thank you guys so much for, for joining us. This Thank is you. absolutely wonderful. More Eyewitness News Saturday morning coming up in just a moment. Y'all come see us.